back with some 10 out of 10s. Let's go. That received 10 out of 10 ratings by Anthony Fantano, a.k.a. The Needle Hey, that's Drop. me. In this video, I want to... I also saw Mad Villainy there you when you pick up the stack. Can't hide it from me. 10 out of 10. I saw I it. I kick things off with albums that received 10s in individual reviews. This is Death Grips's The Money Song. Oh, yeah. I actually much prefer their first mixtape, X Military, to this one, so I that's would it maybe a 7 or 8. A 7? Oh, my is God, a 7? This is To Pimp a Butterfly by Kim Oh, yeah, Lamar. that's a classic. I would rate this one maybe an 11 I was just listening to it yesterday. 11? It's so lyrically wow. dense that the or more 12. time you invest into it, the more you end up getting in return. That's true. Next up is the self-titled project by Kid C. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I actually never really loved this one when it first came out. I really think it was just Pusha T's verse off the top of the album that clinched it for me. I okay. would rate this one maybe four or five. Oh my ten. god! We're not defending this Kanye anymore. We're not. So this we're past that. We're past record. doing that. I would rate maybe an eight out of ten. Just an eight for my girl? Unforgettable track. Next Boys at School does rule. That received tens That's true. And compilation videos that were sorted by decade. Okay. This what is you the got? Beatles, Abbey Road. Yeah. Its influence really cannot be overstated. True. And it's an amazing Easily produced. For me. Hell Next yeah. Next is another favorite of mine. This is Miles Davis's Bitches Brew. Oh yeah. Again, Amazing. this is another 10 out of 10 for Great. me. Glad Next we agree. This is an album that I would give probably an 11 or 12 out of 10. And it's oh yeah. Taste. We're bringing taste. This is What's Going On by Marvin Gaye. Next Amazing is soul record. Next is influential hip hop release. This is It mm -hmm. Takes a Nation of Millions to Hold Us Back by Public Enemy. Mm -hmm. I would rate this one maybe an 8 or 9 out of 10. <gasps> but it's so raw. I prefer Fear of a Black Planet just a little bit more. Okay, valid. Next is Hounds of Love by Kate Bush. This one is mm -hmm. definitely a solid 8 out of 10 for me. Mm -hmm. It's not my favorite Kate album by any stretch of the word. The second half is really kind of crazy. I get it. Moments. It Next does. Is Prince and the Revolution with mm -hmm, Purple mm -hmm, Rain. Mm -hmm, this is another mm -hmm. 9 out of 10. Bangers on bangers. 9 out of 10 valid. Only a sign of the times, just that little bit more. Yeah, Next it's a bigger record, I get it. Next is of Lauryn Hill. Mm -hmm. This is another 9 or 10 out of 10 album for me. Cool. Next is another influential hip-hop release. Yeah. This is Enter the 36 Chambers by Wu-Tang Clan. Mm -hmm. I would rate this one a solid. 10 out of 10. Nice. Next is Discovery by Daft Punk. Okay. And I actually didn't love this album when it first dropped, and it took me really? years to really get into it. I would award it now a solid 9 well, out good. of 10. Well, good. Good, I'm glad. This is Best Routine by Bjork. Uh -huh. I agree That's, with Anthony okay, wholeheartedly good. that this good. one's a 10 That's important. out of 10. That's important. Important the Best Routine is a 10. That's important. Cannot be overstated. That also cannot this be overstated. Mad True. By Mad mm -hmm. And I would and rate this uh, one an easy 10 out of 10. Hell yeah. And that's it for me. Nice. Do you have any Anthony Fantano 10 out of 10 albums in your collection? I, I got a couple. So, I got a couple Anthony Fantano 10 out of 10s in my collection. 